This year's summer heat has been a record high, putting athletes at risk of dehydration and injuries. I met with Mr. Matt, a St. Joe alumni and athlete trainer. Mr. Matt graduated from Southern Miss and began working at Itawamba Community College as an athlete trainer before he joined the Bruin family. He gave me some helpful precautions that athletes should be taking before and during practices and games to stay healthy and safe. Um, drank plenty of fluids, um, not so much in, in the realm of caffeine or anything that's going to act as a diuretic, but um, mainly water, maybe uh, uh, electrolyte drink like Gatorade or Powerade. Uh, and have that in your system as you go into the practice. Mr. Matt listed some of the many ways, such as taking more water breaks, that the St. Joe coaches keep their athletes safe when the heat index is unusually high. So some of the things we've done here at St. Joe to kind of keep the athletes safe, especially in the heat, um, we have a cooling tub um, that is ready to be put together in case somebody uh, may overheat during a practice or game. Mr. Matt mentions the importance of staying hydrated every day and not strictly the day before games. The first sign of dehydration is cramping, but athletes can avoid cramping by drinking plenty of water or Gatorade. Mr. Matt states that diet is equally as important. Athletes should be eating a decent-sized, nutritious meal before practice and games. There's lots of uh, templates and things out there depending on what type of practice you're going to have um, as to what, how to fuel for it. So. If you think of putting fuel in your car to make it run, you would use uh, your nutrition as fuel for your body to make it um, operate at the maximum or you know, potential uh, for a practice or a game situation. Thank you, Mr. Matt, for all the helpful tips on how to keep our Saint Joe athletes safe and healthy.